Well, good morning. I'm going to try and do a, a brief video here from Houston, Texas, where we're working on a house and uh, helping a young family get back in their house. Here, here's Tom. He's getting ready to do some drywall. Tom says hi there. We, this is a home that uh, was just devastated by the flood. There's a, a young family here, and mom and a dad, and a little girl, and there'll be a two-month-old baby here that has been born. But and you can see behind me that the uh, devastation uh, was pretty extensive. What we're focusing on here is getting them a kitchen. So well, this is um, the, the upper cabinets were there, but we're getting a kitchen there. There's Ron walking past me, Ron Hemmickey's on this site. And uh, about a dozen of us down here just working to help this young family get, get back on their feet. There's, there's Mary. She's right down there working hard so that's a new bathroom none of this bathroom is here we're putting tile in there's a new tub a lot of plumbing issues and electrical issues we've had to work through and some closets we're working on and but the really cool thing is is the young man justin has been right here working with us he he was two months old when his dad died and uh his his grandpa actually um left him his this house and so he's got a great opportunity to to really be ahead of the game a little bit and uh to have a place for his young family and you know a place father actually his mom's gonna move in she too needs housing and this is kind of where they were trying to stay and and trying to live with just this bedroom and there's a hot plate right there that they were using to cook and you know it just when the flood happened they just couldn't recover they were just devastated. So we're working with a great little church down here, and Pastor Roger has been here, and uh, one of the other pastors, David, has been here, and really supporting this young family. They're getting them into a Bible study uh, so they can grow spiritually. But I'll tell you what, I'm working with just great people from Christ Memorial. Uh, there's another house they're working on, and hopefully I can get over there today or tomorrow and send you some video from that. But you know what, Christ Memorial, uh, your reach is national and global. And uh, I hope that uh, we, we pause to praise the Lord uh, for, for just what he's doing through us and uh, doing in us and what it means to be part of the body of Jesus, not just in southwestern Michigan, but around the world. I really hope we can do a lot more of these trips. Um, it's part of the heritage and the history of Christ Memorial, um, something that uh, I think we do really well. We're a generous group and we're a compassionate group. We're a group that loves Jesus. Uh, we've had great laughs, great conversations. Um, I hope one of these days I can go on one of these trips with you and uh, we can get our hands dirty and uh, we can hang drywall, we can do plumbing. And you know what? We can help a young family um, really get in a situation where they can break the cycle of poverty and they can also raise their kids in the fear and the admonition of our Lord Jesus. So thanks for all you're doing so we can be down here to do this. I'm going to see you on Sunday. Uh, but again, hopefully I can post another video here in the next couple days uh, to show you what's happening at the other house. A big, big hats off to um, uh, Rich Herbig and to Tim Rotschafer, who are leading this trip, and also to Jason DeYoung. He's not able to be on the trip with us um, because of, he, he's battling cancer, so pray for Jason. Um, but real big hats off. Jason got this thing going. Tim and Rich picked it up and have really led it well. So when you see those guys in church, give them a big hug. Don't hug too hard. They're a little bit sore. <laughs> hey, thanks, everybody. Thanks for praying. We'll see you Sunday.